And here is the sound it makes when your timer actually goes off. All right, quick review. Here goes the remote with all the actual prompts. It's the same as on the side of the actual clock as well. Turn it on with this button here. Comes on super bright. Push the, the brightness down here. You see it goes down and you push the button up and it goes up in increments like that. All right, so now you can go to the timer. You push the center button here and it goes into timer. I've already had used it, so it's on 20, 20 minutes. Timer reset button, it goes to zero. To actually start the timer, you're gonna go right ahead and push either the minute, hour, or second. Do a minute there, and then you're gonna push timer right here to actually start it. Then it goes to start down. You can actually leave the screen and go back to the actual front screen and go back and you'll see it still working, which is great. Now, when you go to the actual 24 hour, 24 hour, you see it there, it goes back to 12 hours. To actually set the timer, you go right here to set, and it gives you all the options, year, month, day, and the time. There you go. And that's pretty much it. This thing is really, really awesome. Um, the timer, it is a little loud. It is loud, so it's not annoying loud, but it's loud enough so you can hear it. And this is going to be great. Um, there goes the sounds. Another sound. And turn it down. And turn it up. That's for the alarm. All right. There we go.